What's going on everyone, Matic here. Today's video, we're gonna continue the race around the track of our nice, hot, and spicy cheeses. Yo! Cool, so this is part two of continuing to eat our nice, hot, and spicy cheeses by Troyer. Um, or at least that is the uh, brand name. This is the Troyer Carolina Reaper Cheddar. It is a uh, reach, reach, yeah, Halo reach. Uh, this is a rich and creamy cheddar blended with Carolina chili peppers, which have a mean, uh, I don't know why they say mean heat, but has a mean heat of between 1.4 million and 2.2 million Scoville heat units. Uh, they didn't do a typo on that one this time. Uh, to give you some perspective, a I will put down here what the Scoville units of the uh, jalapeno and habanero peppers typically are compared to the Carolina Reaper. Uh, in retrospect, the ghost pepper is just under 900,000 Scoville units, uh, and it was pretty good. I liked it. Uh, so we're going to try the uh, Carolina Reaper one. Again, our procedure is this is an 8-ounce block. I will basically eat a uh, quarter of it, so I will eat 2-ounce chunk. After I finish and after I eat and swallow the chunk, I will start our five minute uh, burn down or cookout. Before then, I will drink a little bit of this heavy whipping cream. Again, if you need a source of pretty good, healthy fats, whipping cream is a good source. It is almost exclusively fats, um, and it, it's pretty. It's little. It's basically like really, really thick milk. You can add to your shakes to make them uh, make them really creamy, especially if they're a shake that's kind of a little bit hard to. Uh, take down due to taste or consistency or something this stuff will help a whole lot i'll then drink some water to make sure it all goes down and uh i'll spit out some water that way my mouth is nice and clean to get a full burn and let's get started Okay, so this is a little bit of a uh, longer and thinner block than the uh, ghost pepper one. I think that's just probably just from the forming process. So, I want a quarter, so we're at about half there. Half. So, I'm actually kind of curious on how this one will do. Uh, especially considering that the ghost pepper one, uh, something about the making process, I'm pretty sure, uh, made the peppers hit a lot quicker. So I'm really, really curious on what this does. Here we go. Hmm. Okay. It's almost, it's almost like a sharp cheddar or a sharp cheese. Interesting. Hmm. It's mostly in the kind of the back of my throat a little bit. Or the top, top, back. Hmm. That's interesting.
we go. So starting off, it's it's not really much of a burn. It's I don't know how to describe this. Like it's almost like I can feel the potential of it wanting to burn, but. I don't know. That, that is a weird sensation because I, I didn't taste this when I when I ate an actual Reaper pepper. It's already weakened a lot, like a lot. It's maybe about the same. That potential is like just still there. Like it's wanting to burn. Interesting. I want to add water just to see what'll happen. Screw it. Nothing. Oh my god. That like completely got rid of it. Wow. So it so it maybe had like another 30 to 45 saying it's a burn. And I just got rid of it. Okay, that was uh five minutes. Um I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of disappointed in this one, uh, because the, because at the two and a half minute mark, it had, it, it had, the, the, the heat had gone down so much that I was kind of hoping that adding just a little bit of water would kind of like a a agitate the, uh, the, the main chemical that's responsible for pepper spiciness, uh, capsaicin. Uh, would have like helped spread it around and kind of nothing else like either spread it out or boost it up a little bit but it almost took away took it all the heat away um, which typically doesn't happen with water um, there's a little bit re of residue that's still like we're still trying or wanting to burn again it, it's it's very weird the ghost pepper burned like it, it burned almost like like ghost pepper does um it did activate faster than ghost pepper normally does but it it still like burned um i don't think it burned quite as on par as a normal pepper would but the carolina reaper i mean it didn't burn any it de it didn't it did not burn any hotter than the ghost pepper and it did dissipate. It felt like it was it dissipated either the same amount or faster than the ghost pepper. So uh, at least at least it, it might it might be this block or this bash that they did or something like that. Um, or it might be might it, it could possibly be this cheese isn't actually uh one hundred percent fresh. It is a I have had it for a while. Uh, but it still tastes, the, the cheddar still tasted good, like the cheese itself tasted good, but the peppers that are in it were, like, just not hot. Um, hopefully it's just, like, because of this particular, uh, uh, batch or whatever, or maybe the, the, the manufacturing process, like, actually, this time actually hindered the pepper quite a bit. Um... So, so that's actually pretty interesting. Um, I still liked it, at least the the, the flavory, like like everything kind of combined together, uh, still tasted good. <sighs> Sorry, uh, but yeah. Um, so, yeah. So, if anybody's interested in getting either one of these cheeses. Um, I'll mostly just go ahead and say that my Carolina Reaper one was probably just an oddball. 
but uh, uh but if you are uh, interested in buying any of them uh the they're distributed by so you can probably find them that way uh they are distributed by either it's uh, Lipari or LipariFoods.com, L-I-P-A-R-I-F-O-O-D-S.com. Uh, again, these are the Troyer uh, brand of cheeses, T-R-O-Y-E-R. Uh, the Monterey Jack one tasted good. The, che the cheddar one uh, tasted pretty good. It's just, uh, at least heat-wise and actual good burn, stuff like that. I do kind of prefer the Ghost Pepper versus the Carolina Reaper. Uh, they're both eight ounces. Uh, I did pay, I paid the same amount for them at my local uh, meat store. So I'll probably go by, go by there again and get me another Carolina Reaper. Hopefully uh, that one actually might get me. If it doesn't, oh well. Um, and that's all we got. I'm Maddox, and I'll see y'all next time. Yo! What's going on, everyone? Maddox here. Today's episode... Episode? Why do I keep saying episodes? This isn't fucking important. The script sucks.